Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your girl, Maisha Renee, a.k.a. Glitter and Gills, and I'm in my office today, and I'm doing a little cleaning out, trying to organize some of my lures. I have so many. This is a box, one of my boxes. I have so many lures um, to organize, um, tackle, and things like that. So I was just kind of going through some of this stuff and kind of just, like, lay on the floor, seeing what maybe I could put in the boat, um try to downsize some things just get a little order and just see what i have but the good news i want to talk about is that i got my boaters card y'all y'all been telling me to go out and get it safety course i did it y'all okay i got it <laughs> yes 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 you see that you see that yes let me just come on get that focus in for them please congratulations <laughs> that's me y'all that's me yes y'all so i did it they're feeling very very proud that i have my card y'all let me tell y'all about this boulder card though y'all didn't say that it was going to be extremely long i don't know how long everyone else is um test that has taken it for california it is but for ours you guys this test took me <sighs> It was a literally a forced, like, I think five-hour test, um, course, rather. And, y'all, and it was like, and you couldn't even, like, click, 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 pass. Like, when you know one, just, like, boom. It made you wait, like, 20, I think it was, like, 24 seconds in between each lesson. And so that's what took a lot of time. And, it, oh, my God, I did not like it i did not like it at all y'all i was like this is some bull but i'm glad i did it i did learn a lot so i'm glad i did take it um when i looked up for there's different ones so i got my little blanket y'all because i'm in my office it's a little chilly in here right now it's raining outside california is tripping but um it is it took me like it was literally like i think it said it can be between four and six hours or something like that five or six hours it um it took me five hours you guys and it took me some days to, like taking breaks in between because i was just getting so irritated with it because um i got a life i got things to do and i just could not just sit there straight up and just do it i'm grown okay look i do grown women stuff i got things to do but i did want this really bad so i took the time um and kind of got it done and i'm gonna tell y'all why <laughs> i really put the pedal to the metal and get and finished it up but i'm so proud i got mine my husband got his we took them together and y'all look don't be trying to cheat with you, <laughs> which other person because we was like we gonna do it together we gonna be like okay you know what you got what you got no they they scramble the test up and everything so we're not even getting the same question at the same time so look that it was literally investing our time to get it done and that was tough um so oh and guess what else i got you guys oh so here's my card let me cover my little info but look that's my card i don't know if y'all can see that or not i think my light and camera is not feeling it right now but i got my card it's a real card you guys and i got it really quick i finished the test last week and i got the card um it was in the mail today so that was really really fast you guys it says up to 30 days i got mine less than a week and so i got my test real thing scanner it also tells you to keep your letter that they send you they send you a whole letter congratulations dear boater encloses your california boater card so um but it also has at the bottom of your um letter it has the um your boater card information again just in case you lose your card um this test to take the course was ten dollars so i mean that's super cheap it's a lifetime card so no complaints there you don't have to take it again um, but if you lose the card to replace it, i think it's five dollars um, at least through the place that i went to they have to be approved by um california um boating division i may be saying it wrong but it has this long name let's see here state of california let me see. Oh, make sure y'all ain't got my information. <laughs> State of California Natural Resource Agency, Departments of Parks and Recreation. But um, it's through the boating agency something. I don't know. But um, it has to be. Oh, here it is. Sorry, y'all. Yeah. Okay, so California State Parks Division of Boating and Waterways. 
that's what needs to be approved by your your test um like with the national coast guard all some other type of stuff as well but it'll tell you as well when you're looking up your exams because there's different there's a couple of different um courses that you can take but just make sure that it is approved because if it's not it doesn't even count you guys so keep your letter as well because if you lose it you also have this proof i screenshot it um, once i finished it i screenshotted it on my phone um printed out my cert certificate because you also get a certificate as well so i print that out and um i have that and but oh before we get you know that's what i say we ask you that <laughs> a lot of stuff coming out of the mail for you girl look also let me cover my little goods haha <laughs> that girl got that pink slip for that boat yes i did for all y'all talking about i put money down on the boat it couldn't possibly have been three thousand dollars and about this y'all look pink slip in hand for my boat you guys completely paid up in my name now so boom there it is that is me boat <laughs> Maisha. so got that today be a good mail, mail day y'all because i'm telling you i don't be even checking for the mail because it'll be number bills all right so it's like i have more excitement going to my p.o box because that's where all the good stuff be at the home box that's some bull okay so today was a good day so back to why let me finish doing what i was doing too back to why i really rushed and had to get um my board license all oh, these are good too um i need to get my board license just because we got pulled over <laughs> on the water y'all we got put over on the water um like two weeks ago probably i mean it was only like literally i think like my um my was it my first I think it was like my second, no, it was my second time on the water. Second or third time on the water, you guys. And we were on the Delta. I think it was on the day of what they called it like boat day or something. Like something, I guess it was like the national, I don't know, national boat day. Something Um, they were saying. So I guess it was a bunch of boats out. But yeah, it was sailboats out there and I was stressed out because it was a, it was a parade. And the parade had your girl stressed because I couldn't understand why they would not get out my way. Like, they was, just, I'm trying to just get across. I get, just go down the side, just get out the way so I can get them fish. Look, your girl can't drive that good. I don't want to take nobody out. And it's like, as soon as I be like, okay, good. Let me, let me go. Let me move. Let me move. Oh, here they come. Oh, my God. I was so irritated. I could not understand why they wouldn't let your girl be great. But <laughs> I found out um, earlier that day um, that they were saying that it was a parade for the first day of boating or whatever. So, I mean, my apologies for, I guess, <laughs> trying to come through y'all parade. <laughs> but I didn't get it, okay? I was like, what is going on? They, I'm like, these people are so rude. And they probably saying me, I'm rude. So, good day. Other than, you know, trying to get past that on our way back, it started getting dark. And... I was like getting a little nervous as well because I mean I'm looking like I'm I'm looking at my tracks on the actual um, Garmin and I'm like I, I you know I, I did my waypoint so I can see like you know the way I need to go but it still is getting dark and I'm just a little nervous because of the fact that I don't want to hit anything and it started getting really dark because we kind of like went off too far and so we see like a um, officer you know they go by I kind of waved them like, you know, and so they were like, hey, what's going on? I was like, can you, you know, point me in the right direction? I just want to make sure I'm going into the right direction. I'm trying to get to my dock. I don't want to go to the wrong one and blah, blah, this, whatever. And so they were like, sure, no problem. Go this way. Or matter of fact, you know what I'm saying? Like, just follow us, right? And so we're like, okay, cool. He turned back around, right? <laughs> he goes up because they smash off. And I'm like. Gosh, okay, y'all giving the, me the best of the wakes for real. Because they like smash off. Them boats is very powerful. Like, y'all don't want it with the high speed with them. I'm telling you right now. Because they take off. I'm like, how am I supposed to follow you, dude? I'm not rolling right there, like that. But he, as soon as they get up a little bit, he U-turns around, right? And so now he got the lights on. I'm like, what's wrong with the lights? <laughs> right? And he got the lights on. I'm like, why he got the lights on? He said to follow him. What's the problem? He come back. He like, where y'all red and greens? And I'm like, what? <laughs> he like, where's your red and greens? I'm like, what? Me and us, we looking like, uh, what's that? Because <laughs> we stuck, right? And he like, you're supposed to have your red and greens. And I was like, hmm. 
right so we just looking around i'm like um i'm new we're new boulder so I, I apologize but i have no idea what you're talking about and so he's like you need to have your red and greens he was like based on the fact that if i'm coming in the opposite direction of you i don't know what side you're on you know and all this stuff so he starts breaking it down to me and he was like that's law you need to have that for safety and all this other type of stuff whatever he was like once the sun starts going down those need to go up blah blah, blah. your backlight needs to be and i was like oh i do have my backlight and he was like all right you need to put that backlight in right now and so he i was like okay thank you well he was like look make sure you get it i don't want to give you no ticket he was like but you need to make that happen go get that so it's as soon as possible i'm like do we need to get it installed on our boat or do like because i don't you know i had no idea about this he was like you can find lights you can i mean you can go to somewhere where they gotta install it whatever you gotta do he was just like just don't get back on this water without them red and greens and so i was like all right he showed me an example you know on the other officer boat and then a boat that was also coming that way so i was like okay my apologies whatever i'm gonna make it happen he was like all right he was like y'all follow us out so we'll show you our way out and i was like okay thank you and so, of course, they smash off wherever, right? And so, while they're smashing off, we're like, um, okay, we're going to mosey on to catch up. So, we see them again up, you know, once we catch up to them, we see them up there. And we're like, um, okay, oh, I see on my, we see on our screen that, oh, we're close. We, we figured it out now, you know what I'm saying? We're like, oh, okay, we're almost there. And so, because they're stopped or whatever. It's like three three of them. They didn't caught up with their guys or whatever. And they stopped. But it's dark, you guys. Like, it's dark, dark, whatever, right? And so, we're going. And so, my husband's like, yeah, just go. We're right, because we cool, right? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, we cool. Are we just going to go? So, boom. Like, I'm just still smashing past them, right? Oh, my God. All I hear is... Slow it down. I'm going to get you a ticket. You can't do that. And I'm like, oh, what I do? <laughs> and I'm like, oh, sorry. You can't be going that fast past me. And I'm like, oh, sorry. Because <laughs> I'm like, I, but I have no idea, like, what I've done, right? I'm like, oh. And so he, like, he turned the lights on. Here he go. I'm like, oh, God. What's going on? Why are we getting pulled over? <laughs> On the water, we on the water, y'all. The Delta, this is so wild to me, y'all. And um, so we like, uh, yeah, what happened, right? And he's like, you didn't see my blue lights, and I'm like, yeah, because <laughs> I think I'd look. That's why the boat and safety, y'all, course is very important. I'm like, especially if you don't know, you ain't never been on the water like me. And so I'm like, yes, and he was like. We are, we are sheriff. We are see. He was like, we are police. He was like, if you see a police on the um out, you know, on the streets. He was like, if you see his lights on, don't you slow down. I was like, oh yeah. And he was like, it's the same thing on the water. It's the same thing. We are the police. We are CHP. And I'm like, oh, I'm like, and he's not being rude, but he's just like, girl, you know what I'm saying? And he was like, we are. And I'm just like, oh, he was like, it's safety. It's safety. You have to. He was like. And then he was just like, give me the side eye, right? And I was just like, look at He was like, um, because I'm just like, he about to ask. He like, do you have your boating card? And I was like, uh, almost. <laughs> and he was like, what do you mean almost? I was like, how long have you had this boat? And I was like, only a couple of weeks. I, I was like, I've only had it this year. And I'm like, I've only been driving it. Like, this is my third, second or third time, whatever I told him, um, driving it. Oh, this is nice. Look, can y'all see that? Oh, that light. I was like, this is only my second. I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this with me. I was like, this is only my second or third time driving it. I'm like, so, um, I'm still learning. He was like, he was like, you know, he was like, so then here he, he, he like, he get his tiz up, his rope. And he's like tying his boat to my boat and everything. He got the, the buoys over. I mean, the, what you call the little things? The, um. The fender little bumpers over. He didn't tie us together and everything. I'm just like, oh gosh, what? But they had two other guys, uh, other boats pulled over as well, and that's why he had the lights on because he had the blue lights on. But it was dark, and I just was like, I didn't know. So that is my bad, and that is the reason that um, it is important for the safety course. So I highly recommend to everybody because I learned a lot. But I learned that afterwards i mean because someone could have got hurt you know what i'm saying i could have hurt him like even like he said he was like i could have been crossing over from my boat to another boat and you sit in really big wakes and you could have like you know 
I could have got caught in between the boats if we were trying to save someone's life or whatever because they were overboard. Once again, you're coming with the big wakes, whatever, someone could, anything. So it was like, I totally get it, I totally understand. And I appreciate him explaining that to me. But um, he was not, <laughs> he was fed up with me after that point because he was like, look, I already told you about the red and greens. And I told him to give you a whole little tour back. And then here you come smashing past. So he's like, you know, so at that point he was like, where do you have so he's, he and tied me up right so now he like where's your where, where's your uh where's your throw you got a flow throw and i'm like yes sir. i'm like yeah i do and he like oh he like where's your backlight i'm like i have the backlight he's like where's your extra life jacket blah blah this so i'm like i have we have them on right now and then he was like um where's your fire extinguisher and i was like oh i was like it's right here i have it right so i'm trying to get the fire extinguisher and i'm just and my nails, right? Because I ain't never used to. I'm trying to come, like, oh, shoot. And he, like, it's, I'm like, I know, I'm trying to get it, but I'm thinking, like, I don't want to break up, break my nail. This thing is so, like, tight, the little thing to um, pop a loose. So my husband, like, I get it. So he take the fire extinguisher and he looking at it, right? He, like, he got his glasses. He, like, I'm like, what are you looking at? But we just like this. I'm like, I hope it's all good. Because this is the same extinguisher from the the guy we bought the boat from. And so he looking at, he got his glasses down. It's dark and everything. And um, he like, okay, this is cool. So we like, okay, cool, that's cool. We didn't even know he was checking for it. <laughs> we like, because I was going to just buy a new one. So I'm like, I guess, okay, it's good then, whatever, right? And so um, he was just like, you know, you need to get your boater um, card immediately. He was like, no exceptions, whatever. He was like, you have to get it done. He was like... It's not going to be hard to spot you. He was like, you're the only girl out here driving a boat and a red boat at that. He was like, so if I see you out here again, you're going to get escorted back or I'm going to drive your boat back myself. He was like, and you don't want the ticket either. And they add up. So I'm just like, all right. I'm like, no problem. I apologize. I am good. I'm going to go get it. I'm like, I'm already, um, I've already started. I'm like, I just, it's just taking so long and I just wanted to get back out here. I'm like, but I'm not coming back out till I get it. So that is why... We put the pedal to the metal and finished this just because we clearly was riding dirty. And he, he already told us, he was like, he's not playing about there, pulling people over as they see him over and over. They would like to get it. They was like, and boaters that have been riding and y'all like the G's with it, y'all not getting no breaks. He already made that clear. He was like, because y'all supposed to know. So y'all please get y'all boater card because I'm telling you right now, they going to get their money <laughs> for um what we got coming up memorial day and uh for july oh they're gonna get their money y'all so get y'all boat a card i think that it is any vessel that is over that can go over 15 miles per hour but i could be wrong so do y'all research and check but for sure um you need to have those board license and it is let me see because i did a little i want to at least give y'all the quick little info that i knew all right, I can find for you guys. So who is required? Who's required to get the boater card, right? California, that is us. And can y'all comment below um, wherever you are from um, in your state? Is it a requirement for you to get your boater card? How much did it cost? Um, and how long did it take? And for California, if y'all got y'all's already out here, how long was y'all class? Because my class was miserably long. So how much was y'all's? Let me know. Um... And then, let me see. So, for so um, it was started in 2018. Persons 20 years and younger had to have the card. And so I nobody probably tripping because they're so that was so young. But let's go to current because it it go it's it's been going up five years ever since 2018. The required um age. So let's just come right now. So last year 2022, anybody under 45 years of age or younger. Or younger, 45 years or younger, was required to have a boater's card. So January 1st, 2023, this year, anybody under 50 years old, 50 and younger, is required to have their boater's card. Okay, so if you 51, 52, you don't need to get your boater's card. Not yet. But 2024, next year, this January, that will be coming up next year, persons 60 years of age or younger will be required in California. So if you 60, so if you 55, you ain't got to get it right now, but look, next year you will. 60 years and younger is going to be required to get them um January 2024 and then January 2025, it does not matter. It says all persons regardless of age will be required to get their boat card. So 
if I was you, look, if you 51, 52, whatever like that, just go ahead and do it right now because <laughs> make sure you be 53, you might have had nerves for it. Because <laughs> I'm telling you, if it's anything like my test, you ain't going to be bothered with it. Just don't wait, okay? Don't wait. And look, for my OGs, don't be tripping, y'all. Don't be talking about, look, I've been riding this boat for 30 years. I ain't finna start doing that dumb stuff now. They're going to give you a ticket. Just go on and get it y'all i'm telling you ain't no entitlement of rules i mean um privileges none of that get your bonus card or you're gonna be giving california some money period so just get it done um let's see okay here we go and then here's the fines y'all so for an initial convict uh, and sorry for an initial conviction the first fine you guys is 100 no more than 100 dollars. the next one will be no more than $250 and then the third will be no more than $500 but you know that if it's $500 they're going to give you $500 if it's the second one it's going to be $250 look I don't know about y'all but I like to put that money into my boat my pocket my nails into my lifestyle so I ain't got time to be um, doing that so those are the fines you guys first fine like I said $1 second fine $250 third fine $500 how about let's not have those issues and pay that ten dollars and for lifetime you have your card i mean that sounds great to me um the questions that they ask you oh my gosh y'all they was a <laughs> mines it was a six course i think it was that it went through it took forever just to get through that part when i finally got to the examination oh in each course you had to pass with 80%. So it was like basically you only could miss like two. Uh, you missed three, you was automatically, you had, to do, you had to do that part over. So thank God I was like passing them because I was just like so stressed out at a certain point. Oh, and then make sure y'all always, please make sure y'all always save. Click save. If you decide you want to come out or whatever, push save. Continue. My husband did not save one of his at one point and he had to start all the way over. So at least for that session. So look, nobody got time for that. So make sure you always push, click that save, that little whatever button they tell you to click at the bottom, click it. Also, um, once we finished that, you gotta, I had to do, we had to do like six, um, courses. Um, and then you have to pass them all with 80% at least. And then when you're done, there's time for this. It's the examination, right? Well, the examination had 50 questions. And, uh, oh my gosh, y'all. It was 50 questions. And when, you're do and when you're doing the questions, it's just like <laughs> the stuff they be asking you. Like, I was mad that I did not look at all of the um, videos. I recommend that you do look at all the videos. I started looking at more of them in the um, end, like towards the middle because I was like, okay, I might as well. Because after a while, you're like, I got to wait 24 seconds before I can pass up to the next one anyway. So I just started watching the videos. The videos are super helpful. They make sense. So watch those little clips. It actually helps the time go by anyway. But um, because it's asking you, it'll, it'll, and one of my questions was like, what is this? What does this noise mean? And it was like the horn going, bong, bong. And then there'd be another one, bong, bong. You're like, what? It's so... <laughs> Like, my husband was like, that's the video. I was like, oh, shoot. So my husband kind of gave me the answer for that one. But it was like they was asking you questions that you literally had to remember because they were asking you, like, sounds and things like that, y'all. Um, They ask you, um, like, certain things about, like, oh, life jackets. What is it? They'll show you pictures of the life jackets, different ones. And they'll be like, what is this one for? What is that one for? They may not even give you... All of them they might just when it's time for the test because they the course it explains to you about the um, different life jackets and the buoyancy of them and things like that but then you that you don't hear about that again to probably like maybe 20 minutes later and so with that being said you need to remember or take notes I was taking notes on some of that stuff y'all because I was like I this is gonna come back again so let me write down my certain notes because it will ask you like is this one made for this is this more has more buoyancy than this one and you be like are y'all for real but they those are the kind of questions that are in there um about like the alcohol limits um what do certain signs mean oh they was asking like um the buoys it'll be like um 
what is the red and white what is the white boy with the red stripe mean what is the boy with the green stripe what does that one mean baba or it'll ask you a question or it'll say something like this buoy is is for this or whatever um that you can like tie your boat to this type of buoy but it'll say what color is it so you got to know this kind of stuff you guys it's asking you salt water questions and fresh water questions it is asking you questions about big tow boats and all type of things, you know, the right of ways of which you should be riding on, um, the signals or um, horns you need to be um, knowing, like the bump to pass this way, that way. So take the test, y'all. But I'm telling you right now, if you anything like me, you're going to be irritated. I could be doing so much other stuff and I'll just like this some bug for real. But I'm glad I did because like I said, we learned. Ooh, look at these. Like I said, we learned we learned a lot. Let me show y'all this y'all right here because I'm right though this. Look at that. Oh, this camera ain't giving the. Can y'all see that? I like the color. That's some shit. Like, y'all, how they be doing this? I can't even show y'all right now, but this color is really nice. It's really like a nice shad color. What is this called? I don't know grand bass though it don't have an actual color but it's really nice i love throwing these but you guys take your test because i want to share that with y'all i want y'all let y'all know because everybody y'all all been telling me to take a safety course so i definitely do y'all smell y'all baits <laughs> i definitely um wanted to let y'all know that your girl has been progressing and make home I've been feeling really comfortable on the boat and so I'm also really happy about that but while I was sitting here going through some of my stuff I just wanted to have a little you know a little time with y'all and tell y'all look at that that's a pretty one I like that one so I'm gonna finish going ahead and getting this because I can't go out and fish today it's raining outside um, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish going through my little stuff figure out what I see what I got what can I put I'm trying to make me like a little y'all got so much stuff look at all this I need to do I need to do a giveaway because I have a bunch of stuff you guys maybe I'll do like a little giveaway so I don't know let me figure out something because I do appreciate you guys, all of the tips that you guys have been giving me. And I just want to say thank you guys so much because y'all have really, really helped us out a lot, you guys. I'm out there. I'm always thinking about you guys all the time. Literally, I'm always thinking. I've been like, okay, what did um, what was that tip somebody said about, about you know this? I'm always thinking about you guys. Are like some of the things that you guys have said to like do or watch out for or make sure or try this. Like when that when that situation like um presents. I'm literally thinking about, I remember like what you guys said and then I'm the, the answer that you guys told me like to do, the advice, the tips, like it comes right to me. So you guys are so super helpful. Y'all just don't know. It means a lot. Like I love you guys for that. Like y'all's my tribe. I'm telling you, y'all really have helped me through my whole like journey is like between my husband. Yes, that is my rock. Y'all, he been getting me through. <laughs> he deal with me and my shenanigans and I mean like I'm so thankful for him and like you guys I mean like yeah, I'm so thankful for y'all I'm talking about y'all when I say you guys I'm talking about my girls too all of y'all you know what I'm saying y'all you know that's my word y'all <laughs> all of y'all are so helpful so supportive you guys encourage me because I'm telling you it's been a time like twice where I was like so nervous out there and I'd be just like oh my god like the wakes are like coming or something and I'm thinking about oh okay I remember one of like somebody said make sure I do this and blah blah that and so I appreciate you guys so much I mean god bless y'all for just taking out the time to write out like the really long detail like tips y'all I like that I, I love that so I love to learn so it's very helpful and I also think that it's really really great because in that um in that post of me learning how to drive the one the first one there is so many freaking comments in there you guys and I have had people like literally saying how much it has helped them and it's like a little mini form right there it's so great so who's ever um, watching this video for the first time if you guys are new boaters or if you're experienced boaters go to my um video the first one with me driving I'm doing a little peace sign on there 
go comment if you have any tips and if you guys are looking for tips looking for answers and you guys are new drivers that cop that comment session is popping y'all so go check it out i appreciate you guys i love you guys for that so i'm gonna go ahead and go through this stuff let me show y'all a couple of my cute my little cool little things really quick this one right here um I know someone asked me in a previous video when I was fishing because I am, I bank fish all the time. I love bank fishing, you guys, um, as well. So go check some out my previous videos. I have some really good videos where I'm catching, catching frogs and everything, y'all. But um, I remember using this and someone was asking me. So this is, um, a Vi if you're watching, this is the Viocraw by Biosent. And... There it is. Really pretty. This is the one that you asked me for if you're watching. You asked me who was it by because you used it before as well. And that is by Viocraw. And you know you can break it apart so them legs get to going. Really nice bait. And it has a, a smells like anise on it. Um, Let's see. I don't know what the scent is on here. But it has a scent. But this is the package, y'all. This is the package. So, hope you're watching. This is the one because I couldn't remember for you. Really good bait. Or lure. But, just going through some of my stuff. I got some good. Look, look at that frog. That's a cool little frog, huh? You look like a Jordan. <laughs> you look like a Jordan shoe. Me too, fly. I don't know. Can y'all see that? It looks like you can. This is crazy. Oh, he's a frog too. Like I've really been throwing him. He all flat. And you gonna get thrown some more too. Look, we gonna finish you off. Going over there, Mama gonna finish you off. Oh, these are nice tickle tails. See that? Oh, these are my little extra tips. So whenever I have like a broken tip, I can fix it. Oh, now these are nice right here. Check them out. Those are nice. Love these. Maybe I'll give like some of these. Well, I don't know. I need to look at that one. That's a nice size. I like that small size. Can you see that? I like that small size right here. I need to be having this with me. Look at y'all telling you. Your girl. Oh, yes, honey. Look. Now that's a good one right there. Can y'all see that? That's a paddle tail, too. This good right now, especially if you can find them on their beds. Y'all, I have caught many, many, many bad fish. And beastie them girls with bluegills, bluegills with um, bluegill lords with trebles on them. They don't like that. You know they don't like bluegills nowhere near that. Look at that one. That's some good stuff. Oh, that's a nice one too. A bullgill. Oh, he nice. Yeah, he going on the boat. Slow sinking. And I have so many of these things as well because, like I say, I'm um, bank fish all my life. But I've never... Oh, here goes some line. Look, I've been looking for a fishing line. You guys, what braid do you... I have the hardest problem remembering remembering what braid that I um buy when I get a good one. I can't never remember which one is. I keep throwing the cases away. So, which braid, you guys, what do y'all use? I, I'm always using at least... 20 pound 20 to 30 pound that's just for me i can't even go any lower i've had too many bad experiences with anything lower than that but sometimes the brand that i get me let me down like i literally just unspooled a rob because i kept breaking off like that line was trash so i kept that box but let me know what you guys recommend because i just want one that i can remember and stick with check that out I got a million low. Very big. Look at that one. I love me some um some lizards. What's 
a nice color for the Delta. Delta like colors like purples and blues and things like that. Some catfish bay holder stuff. I ain't never used this. Have y'all used this before? Never used it. But that stuff that you use to go with it is stank. So well, this is nice. Some zoom base, y'all. I got too much stuff. But I'm just trying to. Oh, that looks good right there. Look at these. Look at them. Them look good. Can y'all see that? Look at all that play. Oh, yeah, I like it. I like me some crawls, y'all. And Delta like crawls, too. Those. I got a bunch of these. That's how much stuff. So, um, that's what I'm going to be doing here. Go another one. I'm going to keep that because these are good right now. Um, that's what I'm doing right now, y'all. I'm just kind of like going through this stuff, but I wanted to share that. I see those. I like paddle tails, too. Y'all like paddle tails? I like paddle tails. I'm just going through this stuff to see. This my babies right here. Oh, I was looking for y'all. <sighs> y'all. These right here. Get your bags. I'm buying a little bit small packs. These right here. Uh uh. <laughs> Babies, y'all. Mm. Let me tell y'all right now. Let me tell y'all right now. Yes, these right here. Mm. I love me some black and blues, y'all. I'm telling y'all. My black and blues. Yes, and these right here. Get them out of that. They can't be over there. Look at these. Yes, y'all. I caught my PB. I caught my PB on this exact baby right here. Almost nine pounds. Yes. Can y'all see that? Yes, I did. I caught my PB. And you are going. And now I can finally throw them from the boat. I'm excited. These go over there. Y'all deserve better than to be inside here. You want some more of these? But I have a bunch of stuff, y'all. What y'all think about red hooks? A lot of people swear by them. I've never really used them. I like these too. I think this color is called Baby Bass, I think. Um... This might not be the right pack, but it says watermelon lamb. I guess we're just called baby bass. I don't know, but anyway, look, bluegill hooks, <laughs> Dooney and Burke sticker. <laughs> I put that on my little box. Just come with your little purses. Look, your girl, you know she love bows sometimes. So, all right, you guys, we're we'll finish going through this stuff. Need to kind of like put things in order a little more so I can find things a little bit easier. But, um, you guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel, you guys. Um, it's a lot of work behind the scenes to um, try to put this together for y'all. Even this video, it's like I'm just talking and chilling, but I still got to make sure that it's right. Got to upload it, do all this, and it's a lot that goes with it. And my videos when I'm out and about. Or a lot of work, a lot of detail. Um, my husband, you know, he's trying to get footage for me when he can. But then he also wants to be able to fish as well. But, I mean, I'm always, you know, trying to get it going for you guys. And, I mean, me trying to hold the hand, the camera. It's a lot. So, um, but I love it. I wouldn't change it. I'm so happy that I'm able to share with you guys. And so, please like, share, subscribe. Do one of them, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Show love. Let them know you girl out here trying to diversify the outdoors. And as always, catch these smiles. And I'm going to catch you guys later. All right? Love y'all. See y'all on the Delta. Hopefully, y'all better say something to me. Bye.